in the next hour. No doubt about it. In the meantime, we shall move on here coming up at 930. No Shave November is over, and that means it's time to trim some of those beards. Guys, if you've been growing them for charity, this is Reckoning Day. Add up those donations, get it off to charity, and shave those beards. A couple of Arlington's finest are going to join us live in the loft for their first shave in 30 days. Oh, for so. Kaylee Roth, back with the Check of the Weekend forecast in just a moment. And the big changes coming our way next week. Stick around for that. Thomas, thank you very much. Mike's got that baby face. He doesn't have to worry about this. It's December. It's No Shave November is over now, officially behind us as we turn the page on the calendar. And for those unfamiliar with No Shave November, it is actually a charity event encouraging men to use the money they would normally spend on razors and shaving cream to donate to various causes. And this year, get this, 58 members of the Arlington County Sheriff's Department participated in No Shave November, starting with clean shaven faces in compliance with the department's policy on hair, ended the month with various stages of facial hair, and the participants raised $3,000 to be donated to Virginia Hospital Center. And this morning, we are joined by three of those 58, one barber, and also a representative from Virginia Hospital Center. Thank you all for joining us this morning. Adrian, I'll get to you in just a second. I want to talk to you guys. First of all, uh, uh, first of all, you're, you're halfway done. We started early. We started <laughs> early. Uh, Juan, uh, you've got the microphone on, so let me ask you, first of all, it, the policy is to not be able to grow beards in the department? Well, we have a grooming policy, so uh, that requires us to be clean-shaven when we're on duty, and so, you know, when we're on vacation, we love growing that beard, and we have to say goodbye when we come back to work. All right, so, so Juan, Tim, and Chris, longtime veterans here of the Arlington County Sheriff's Department. Uh, Chris, we got a head start on you. Unfortunately, you've been walking around the last few minutes with half a beard. Uh, Munchie's back here with us once again. He's going to take care of the rest of that. So why don't you uh, finish working up on Chris? I'm going to move the microphone away from him so you can finish there. I'll come back over here to you, Juan. Uh, is this something you guys have done before, or was no. this the first year you decided to do it? First year, a buddy of mine, Lieutenant Rob Lutz, and I, uh, we proposed it to our Sheriff, Beth Arthur. And uh, she approved it, and uh, we, the, the results exceeded our expectations. Hang on one second, guys. We're getting breaking news in right now. I want to let you know we're going to have to go to a special cut-in right now. Stand tight. We'll come back to you guys. In the meantime, we do have breaking news. Let's get to that right now. All right, listen, before we went to that uh, breaking news update, we were talking about the members of the Arlington County Sheriff's Department who uh, did, uh, were shaving for charity right now. They've been growing their beards out all month long. Chris already got shaved right now. Tim is getting his clean shave right now. By the way, Tim, uh, I don't want to say anything while the razor's right by your face, but happy birthday today. <laughs> Getting yourself a birthday shave. Munchie's taking care of that. Now, the other part of this, these guys did their job. They grew out their, their razors. They raised some money. Where does the money go? Come on and bring that check presentation in here right now because we love the visuals as well. There you see right there, $3,000 going to Virginia Hospital Center. Adrian is with Virginia Hospital Center. How does this help you guys? Well, first, on behalf of Virginia Hospital Center, I want to thank uh, the Arlington Sheriff's Office for this generous grip. It will actually go to support and grow our cancer services. Uh, that's fantastic. And things like this, when, when people help out, even the little amounts help, right? Absolutely. And, it, and it's a sense of community spirit. Uh, so we appreciate the uh, uh, gesture by the sheriff's office, and uh, obviously it will go to good use at the hospital. Absolutely. We love the community partnerships. Thanks to all the guys in the Arlington County Sheriff's Department who are doing this. Now, we mentioned there are more than 50 who have done it. Chris, you're already clean-shaven. Tim is now clean-shaven as well. Juan, we're going to give you a pass. You're going to get to keep that beard for a few more minutes at least. But uh, another, uh, a number of other uh, members of the department are going to have their beards removed later today, right? Correct. At 11 o'clock at the courthouse plaza, right in front of the courthouse in the Arlington County Jail. They're going to do a little ceremony there to present the check again there at the courthouse. That's going to be fantastic. Well, listen, uh, gentlemen, we appreciate your time, appreciate your service to the community. I uh, hope you enjoyed the beards while they lasted because now they're gone until next year. Thank you guys for coming in, Tim. Happy birthday. Uh, and for folks who want to sign up next year, uh, check out uh, all the organizations where you can contribute to charity as well. Thank you, gentlemen. Allison, we'll send it over to you.